I want to ask you the, the, yeah. the, the, the next clause, clause 5-5, five, five, clause 5-5 five, five, says the head coach shall work under the supervision of the national technical director. Uh, gentlemen, the head coach, I repeat, is there a clause 5-5? Five, five, you can read it there, clause 5-5. Five, five. The head coach shall work under the supervision of the national technical director. I mean, if I am Keshi's lawyer, yes, the very first thing is, what am I there for? Okay. What is the meaning of head coach? Oh. When I have a supervisor that will determine who is going to be my team players, that is going to pick and select the group of players that I must feel to play for Nigeria, and at the same time, you have a clause like this that say, well, even though we gave you all of these people, you will still report to our supervision. We will supervise you on the players that we gave you. So what is my job? I will ask my client, what is really your so how, job? What, what, do you want that clause expunged or what or how? Deleted. 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 All right. The lawyer says, OK. But, but, but I, I think we need to tread with caution a bit. No, we're, 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 no, no, no that's yeah. we're asking you. You have your, you have your opinion. Yeah. Exactly. Do, you, do, yeah. you, do you support it yourself? The lawyer does not support it. What I'm saying so the head coach shall work under the supervision of the national technical director. Do you agree if it's OK by you? I, I'm going to put this question back to him. Yeah. Who will supervise Keshi in the EFE? If he's not working under anybody's supervision, you see, you might want to uh, look at Keshi's antecedent and consider where the FA2 uh, were coming from. At a point, Keshi became like, like had a larger than life image, and everybody was just barraging the FA with insult and lot. And they were they're just trying to put Keshi in check. Keshi still has to report to somebody. It's not that every every time anything happens, you feel you can go above your employer. Yes, it's good to know people uh, everywhere, but you can't go above your employer to do some certain things. And for me, I think this contract, they're just trying to clip his wings and let you know, okay, yes, the FA, the FA is your employer, and you must respect uh, them. Okay, let me know. I, 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 I agree with what you're saying, but I want to ask you this. Is a contract not supposed to be something that will make progress? Is it supposed yes. to be a, and must a fight? Be, it I mean, fight. And it's not two people who want to enjoy themselves, enjoy themselves and achieve success. Are you, are you trying to say mutual consent? Mutual mutual benefit. Yeah. You see, it, 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 mutual benefit. He, he yeah. said something at the beginning. Yeah. Get, let, let's get something clear. Yes. This is an offer. This is we, the we way are, we want we, it we as are, an employer. We are offering you yes, this. Yes. Yes. Then you now come okay. with your own terms. Let's let's look no, at it. I agree. That's what we are looking. That's what we are asking but, him. Yeah, in terms but, of but I'll, I'll, I will give him. I will give him yeah. the reason why you have to delete it, because there is another section of the article. There is another section yes. that says performance based contract, yeah. meaning. Keshi will be evaluated yep. to <laughs> determine if he met the performance requirement. If it's going to be meeting performance requirement, and then you have the technical group pick his team. Hmm. So, See, I mean, no supervise his team. No no way in the contract yeah. has it been stated that the technical committee will pick okay, his team. Okay, please let us let us let us let us go let us go through this. Let's go through it again. Let's, let's, let's go through it again. Let us go through all this. He said the head coach. Uh, let us go to uh, uh, clause five sixteen, clause five one six, please. The head coach shall obey all lawful technical directives of the technical committee. All are lawful you? technical yeah, directors. Yeah, so what, exactly. what, what are the technical directors? You have to look, oh, obey all, all lawful, lawful technical directors. Oh. So, uh, they they did not say <laughs> some. They said uh, all. Uh, have uh, uh, they so now mentioned there that we're going, we're going to impose player okay, on you? Okay, can you give no, us no, an no, no, example no. of any lawful directive Directive. Uh, uh, technical exactly. directive. Direct. Yeah. Technical directive could be, okay, we're having a, a partnership with this particular club. Yeah. Go there for two weeks. No, no, no. I think we are technically about players. All right, it sounds ambiguous. The first statement Yemi okay, made right, okay, okay. actually negates the, the principle of okay, utmost good faith. When you say the, 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 the wings of Keshi would be clipped with, with this see, contract, with this that means the utmost good faith is not there. It's more, oh, it's more or less, more, okay, okay, let okay, us keep okay, your wings okay, with this okay, contract. Okay, let's, let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> We're enjoy, let's move on. Let's go to clause 10 to 4. Clause 10 to 4. Uh, it's, a bit long, it's, it's a bit longer, which I'll try and see if we can take it a little bit faster. So that uh, we are running out of time exactly, so that we can get something. Else. Okay, that that let me start doing why, why you are why you are getting there. He said that he shall not engage in any other service or businesses whatsoever. Okay, we agree to all that. Then he said, all such personal endorsements shall, however, be subject to the concurrence, approval, and consent of the NFF first and obtain. Uh, anything wrong? I want to say something on that. Yeah. Okay. We are in Nigeria. Yeah. Where the corruption in this place us as number 57 in the world. Okay. <laughs> now, you are telling me 
anything concerning endorsement mm. which has nothing to do with football operation for me to engage in personal mm. issues mm -hmm. now i am being given an endorsement by other parties mm. i am going there let's say a sickle cell foundation yeah. Yeah. i go there and they say well we will do this we'll pay your expenses for endorsing mm. us i need to get approval from NFF. That's and absolutely it, unnecessary. Right, and okay. NFF absolutely will say, okay, let's grab that. We have a few minutes. I, 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 I totally disagree. Sorry, sorry, without yeah. a few minutes to go. So that, that, yeah. let me just read this to so that we can. We have, we have about three minutes or so. Yeah. So let us see this uh, clause, clause 11 3, clause 11 3, just tell us that we didn't take any calls today. He said, he shall be ready to accept technical assistance whenever the NFF finds it necessary. Necessary. You accept that? He shall be. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You are not going to give it to the players. You are not going to give it to the players. You give it to the players and you must say no. At the point, at the point, at the point where we feel you can no longer give us what we want, we will write. We are supposed to write that there. All right, all right, gentlemen. Okay, let's let me do it. Okay, the code of conduct, code of conduct, just the last three code of conduct that we leave here. Uh, coaches must not use ethnic or religious uh, uh, criteria for uh, right. evaluating players. Uh, coaches must not collude within themselves or other parties to um, deliberately mislead the technical committee about a player's performance. And then coaches must not solicit for or receive donations and gifts on, for, uh, on their terms without the written consent of the NFL. Then the last one, coaches must at all times submit to the supervision of the technical departments. You see, one thing I want us to understand is yes. yeah. for <laughs> any employer that employs an employee, yeah. there is a, a, a line of reporting. Mm. And whether yeah. you like it or not, that's where the technical committee is. And you see, like Jimmy said, it has to be a synergy. The coach must not see himself as, as above as his above employers. His employers, employers. Must not and the employers must give him the The question would be, is it the technical committee employing Keshi now? Or it is the, the, NFL. the NFL. It is the NFL. But the, right. the technical committee that has okay. been properly formed for right. two years. You can follow, properly properly for two years. You can follow us on Twitter. Properly the formed for two years. The discussion continues to just start here. You can follow us on Twitter. Our feedback mechanism will be right here. I hope we can have it so that you can follow us. We retweet you. We reply you. We engage you uh, while this thing goes. Uh, while the discussion continues. I know that during the week, we expect, yes, that is it. You can, you can meet us right there. Uh, that is um, at channels underscore sports. And uh, at Ken Ochonogo, uh, that is also as our Facebook page. So you can be part of this discussion. We retweet it. Uh, one, we're going to have positive contribution on how these things can be solved. How we can have a mutual uh, a relationship between the coach. The coach is not just Keshe as a coach and the federation. Anybody who wants to sign this contract, a contract similarly, something like this. Let us see our input. And also, gentlemen, we are, we are, we are, we are living here. Rashi, thank you for coming. Uh, Jimmy, uh, Manchester United players are also there. Last school, Dana. Manchester United, please. Arsenal all the way. Arsenal all the way. Arsenal all the way. Man United all the way. Hey, okay. Hey. A neutral. I am a City fan. All right. <laughs> <laughs> For you guys at home, it is Channel Sports on Sunday. Sorry, we couldn't take your calls today. Uh. But that is how tight the program is. Until we reach you, let's pick Sunday. I'm Ken Ochonogo. Let's keep marching in March. <laughs>